Good morning. It's bright and early. I was supposed to come out yesterday, Boxing Day. Uh, it's my birthday, but the weather wasn't the best. <laughs> Let's say that. I was supposed to meet up with John Pomsey, but I think our paths crossed at some point. He was going back home and I was coming down here. But today's a different day and we got a new toy. This is uh, this is my actually my birthday present from the wife. And we've got the GoFind 66. It's not, it's not difficult to set up at all. Uh, the reason I wanted this is because by trade I'm a roof tiler. So I thought it'd be quite handy if I could take a machine to work with me. Just in case I get the off chance to have a dig in someone's garden or if I'm close to a beach, I can take it to work and have a little play. Right, literally to use it, that's your sensitivity, which I'll probably knock down a bit as I'm only looking for coins. Uh, that's your discrimination. We don't want anything iron, so we notch that out. There's your volume, and that's your backlight. Simple as that. I purchased this from Leisure Promotions, so thank you very much, Pete. And one of the main reasons I got it from them one, because I could use uh, the other YouTubers that are sponsored by them. I could use their discount to get 10% off. Also, at the moment, they're running a promotion where you get some free mine lab gloves. As well as getting the gloves, you also get the bag, which I'm told is an, an added extra. So they're chucking that in and the gloves. So we're good to go. Let's do it. Looks like we got a target already. It's telling me it's a ring. I'm pretty sure it's probably not. Hopefully you can see the dial. And now I should imagine that's about four inches deep. Give it a magic foot scrape. Tell me it's there. Oh, there it is. There's a coin. I can see a coin, a goldy colour. Just there. Oh, I'm going to get my new gloves dirty now. What we got? That is... Is that 10 cents? That is 10, 10 euro cents. That's quite handy. I'll, I'll take that with me next time I go to Cyprus. I will say, this is so light, and it almost, almost feels a little bit flimsy. But it is only a cheap entry-level detector, so it is what it is. We've got another. That's not very deep, is it? That's telling, telling me it's a ring. Can't be. Oh, there's a coin. There's a 20p in it. Looking like a 20p. A scabby 20p at that. Well, at least it's it's finding coins, so it can't be all bad. Same hole. I like the look of that dollar sign. I need a dollar, dollar. Oh, there it is, on the top, it's a nugget. And there it is. It's our first nugget with a go find. Beautiful. Right, I did cheat a little bit. I bought my pinpointer. But we've got another, supposedly another ring. That's the only thing about this machine. Everything you find is gonna be a ring, but obviously we know it's not. What have we got here? Oh, it's another coin. Yeah, another coin. Oh, I think that's a penny. Don't ever find them ever again. That's another dollar sign. Oh no. Another machine that finds aluminium. Hmm. 
Well, there's our next one, just down there. Believe it or not, that coming as a as a ring as well on the on the go find. But we take that. There's also an app. I've downloaded the app. I haven't really had a proper play with it yet. But once I uh, get the hang of that and master it, I'll show you the app as well, which is pretty cool because you can look on when you get back from your hunt. You can look on the maps as to where you found what and what you found. So you'll find little hot spots. You can have a look at the maps and see whereabouts on the beach you was most productive where wasn't and blah 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 so we'll have a look at that next time so weird not having a spade this hand don't know what to do with itself and i keep looking around thinking i've left it somewhere <laughs> well this one telling us coins coins of money coins of money and a ring <laughs> can't be bad well, that's... Out there, I'd say. Alright, let's test out, the, let's see what the digger's like. I'll tell you what, that's not bad, actually. Where is it, then? Ah, oh, you absolute lie. You said it was a coin. Right, well, let's have a quick look then. I've had a, I think I've probably had about an hour. Had a quick, quick hour. Got the little, little fishing weight. 20 pence piece, the 10 cents. Pound coin, or nugget as I like to call them. Crusty old penny. Couple of bits of aluminium. I just want to quickly do a quick uh, recovery speed test. I'm going to line a random amount of these in a line, put them closer together and just see how fast the machine is. Obviously it's, it's only a, an entry level machine so don't expect too much, but let's see how it gets on. Well, there's the pound coin, 20 pence and the 10 euro cents. I think struggling a little bit with that. Don't think I can go too fast. So that's not too bad, they're fairly fairly close together. I can't really do a depth test today because I haven't bought a shovel. But first impressions, I like it. I do obviously I've bought well my wife's bought me one so I do like it. I'm not sponsored by anybody so I haven't got to pull any punches or lick any bottoms. So uh i would say it's it's a bit it feels a bit cheap obviously i'm not stupid i know it is a it is an entry level machine it just feels to me a little bit a little bit flimsy i'd say but performance wise i cannot knock it obviously i'm going to learn more about it as i as i use it but first impressions i like it the control panel is an absolute doddle I can't lie, it's it's foolproof, it really is. You've got your sensitivity. I did notice today, uh, you're, you're probably better off knocking the sensitivity down one or two notches because the slightest touch of the coil and it will force out. So knock it down a couple of notches and you'll be fine. Obviously, discrimination, can't go wrong. That's that's all metal. I don't know if you can see the screen actually, that's probably better. That's, that's all metal, that's notching out iron just leaves your foil your ring pulls which I didn't actually I didn't find the ring pull today which I'm quite pleased with then obviously you've got your last two and then that's the big boy that's where that's where you get your treasure and bottle caps so don't be fooled apart from that you've got your backlight and you've got your volume like I say absolute doddle and as far as I'm aware putting it away we turn it off just slide that down release the catch push that in fold that flap that hold that down and you're done pop it in your bag and off you go so i hope you found this useful uh like i say if you want to purchase one of these nip on to leisure promotions or there's i think there's other other obviously shops that are selling them but i think it's just leisure promotions where you get your free gloves 
uh, and obviously like I say you can use the discount code so nip over there grab yourself a bargain and I'll see you next time take care